considered the region R, which is collection of all x, y, such that x is less than equal to y, and y is less than equal to 9 minus 11 by 3 x square. And x is greater than or equal to 0. So first one is y equal to x, boundary line is y equal to x, which will be a straight line. And second one is y equal to 9 minus 11 by 13 x square, which will be a downward parabola. So let's construct these two curves. y equal to x will be a line which is passing through origin and having slope 1 like this. The second one is y equal to 9 minus 11 by 3 x square. So when you're putting x equal to 0, you'll get y equal to 9. So it is downward parabola having vertex 0, 9. Something like this. 0, 9 is its vertex. So we have to find y less than this. So y coordinate is less than this parabola and more than this. And x is greater than or equal to 0. x equal to 0 is the y-axis. So basically we are talking about this region. Now in this region, what we need to find? We need to find the area of the largest rectangle of sides parallel to coordinate axis. So it will be something like this, a rectangle of this nature, which is having sides parallel to coordinate axis, so x and y axis. So basically we need to consider the parametric coordinates on the parabola in a straight line. So any point on this straight line y equal to x will be of the form t comma t. Both the coordinates will be same. And since this line is parallel to y axis, so any point on this line will have same x coordinate. So we will be considering x as t. And when we put x equal to 2, we get the parametric coordinate of parabola, which is 9 minus 11 by 3 t square. Now we need to maximize the area of the rectangle. What is area of rectangle? Area of rectangle is length into breadth. So this distance is what? This is t unit. And what is this height? That will be difference of these two y coordinates, which is 9 minus 11 by 3 t square minus t. So basically it is depending upon t. So we can call it as function of t. And do the multiplication, it is 9t minus 11 by 3t cube minus t square. To minimize or maximize any function, we have to differentiate it. So when we differentiate this, we will get 9 minus 11 uh, 3t square into 3. So 11t square minus 2t equal to 0, which is 11t square plus 2t minus 9 is equal to 0. That gives us t is equal to negative 1 or 9 by 11. Negative 1 we have to reject because we are talking about the right side of y axis. So t must be positive. So t equal to 9 by 1 is the only possibility it must give you maximum. Otherwise, we can check using double derivative also whether it is maximum or not. Differentiating this function one more time, we get negative 2, negative 22t. And yes, putting 9 by 11 over here it is turning out to be negative. So that is point of maxima. Now, what do we need? We need the maximum area, the area of the largest rectangle. So let's find out the area of the largest rectangle by putting t equal to 9 by 11 in this function. Let's put it here. So it will be 9 by 11 into 9 minus 11 by 3 into 9 by 11 whole square minus 9 by 11. Let's simplify this. It will be 9 by 11. This 11 and 11 we can cancel out. 3 and 9 we can cancel out. So 9 minus 27 by 11 minus 9 by 11. So this will turn out to be 9 by 11 into 99 minus 36 by 11. Again, it will be 9 into 9 minus 6 is 3. 9 minus 3 is 6, 63 by 11 into 11 is 121. So this will be 567 by 121. 567 by 121 is, okay, it should be 561 by 121. Must pray. So answer is C, just 567 by 121.